Hello everyone, this is Lunacy05 and welcome back again to my nostalgic reviews. Today I'm doing a special review for a friend of mine who actually owns the 1988 Matchbox release Ring Raiders. The Ring Raiders actually came out with an animation as well. If you don't know or, or if you haven't seen the animation before, you can always do a search for YouTube and browse for the videos itself. The videos actually exist. Now let's take a look at the toy itself as advertised at the package itself the whole purpose of the toy is <clears throat> playing the ring ray this is to slip it onto your finger like so you can also have a squadron of them for all of your four fingers and then you have a squadron of the ring raiders as shown in the video here now, for articulation wise, there, uh, yes, there is some articulation, but there's not much. Some of the planes actually came with propeller, but it's a bit stiff, so it doesn't spin as much. There's actually joints, so you can turn the plane down or turn it to the back. You can also move the joints below here and turn it like this, like so, or to the back like so uh, the other gimmick would be besides the ring itself uh, there's a clip on below the leg, uh, ring for you to place it onto if you have a solid plastic wall or a wooden wall tin one as long as it, it can fit the clip on you just slip it in and display your ring radius each of the package came with a mini comic And here's the comics, the comic strip, and an instruction stating you can actually pull out the joints, uh, stating about the clip-on, and well, display it wherever you like. Speaking of display, I forgot to mention, you can actually, as shown, you can actually display it like this. Now back to the mini comic, at the back of the mini comic itself, shows the catalog now there are two factions in the ring raiders the ring raiders will be the good guys as shown in the yellow bar and the skull squadron which we which is are the bad guys majority of the of their planes are painted in black well their body, the plane's body, are painted in black, but you can see they are white. Some of them, uh, a lot of them are have white colors, some of them are in green, and so on. While the good guys, Ring Raiders, are painted in very brightly colored colors. They also came out with play sets. This is the Air Carrier Justice Command Base. This is the Skybase Freedom Mobile Recon Base. This is the Skybase Courage Mobile Assault Base. This is the Skull Squadron Mobile Base. This is the Air Award Series as shown here. I'll explain that soon. This is the Battle Blaster. Blue for the Ring Raider. Black for Skull Squadron. Uh, the whole gimmick of this is when the kid slipped the hand to the harness as shown here and then grabs hold on the joystick there's two buttons you can actually you press the buttons and it, it simulates the sound effects of the uh, dog fights and you can also clip on the planes itself the ring raiders or the scout squadron onto the battle blaster here we have the display for the wing command display stand where you have the rings and you can clip it on and the animation now to explain the air award series I'll bring the camera forward this is the air award series each of the air award series came with a pair of chrome colored planes with medals according to the animation the characters will activate the ring the, the star there 
and then the entire plane itself will be engulfed with this metallic chrome some of them will be in gold some of them will be in silver but this enhances the plane's strength speed and fighting ability so it's quite unique actually now I want to show you the back of the packaging the back of the packaging is the same th same deal you have the short bio here the metals the faction of Ring Raider and Skull Squadron the play sets the other toys and the character bio very very small very little character bio this is Commander Miles Aericon Officer each of the squadron came with a commander one commander the rest of the planes don't have a name so if I'm gonna give a rating of these toys I would say 6 out of 10 they're, because they're interesting they're inter interesting you can play with your hands and you can have a lot of imagination with these toys and they are very detailed colors so thanks for everyone for watching this video this is Lucy05 signing off